Welcome back to the channel guys. Today we've got a very special NFT project for you. This one's definitely a hidden gem and it's called the Multiverse of Women. This is a very unique project and we definitely wanted to get some coverage on it. And we're going to go through all of the details of the project, go over their social media, their roadmap, and also their causes for this project. I think they've got some great causes and a good roadmap. Now, before we get started, I do need to let you know that I am not a financial advisor. So anything that I do say in this video is my own personal opinion and make Sure you do your own research before you invest in this nft or any others and make sure you never invest more than you are willing to lose now with all that being said we'll get started here now while reviewing the site i wanted to come down here about halfway to start it's their mission statement now first it says the multiverse of women is a community promoting the advancement of diverse women in society technology and the crypto space we strongly believe our project will make a meaningful difference to the lives of women across the globe so that was big for me that's what i think sets this project apart from most others out there they are a specific cause which is women which is typically underrepresented in the nft and in crypto space in general so i think this is amazing and i think that's why this project has so much value and it goes on to say our mission is to bring more women into the nft space support and help them thrive we seek to drive the importance of inclusivity in the space through our project and messaging this is not just an art project this is a community, a community that will empower women across the globe, a community that will change the world. We welcome you to step into the multiverse and become part of this journey. So that was their big hook for me. They do mention this in kind of their opening statement at the top as well, but I wanted to start here because I think this was their big hook for me. All right, and going into the details of this project, this is going to feature 10,000 randomly generated digital collectibles of various rarity. They will be living on the Ethereum blockchain as ERC721 tokens and hosted on IPFS. And it says, each Multiverse of Women NFT is not only an awesome fine art JPEG, but is also an exclusive membership card that allows access to member-only benefits, which will be revealed over time. Now with their membership, it says you will receive voting rights, governing MOWs philanthropic efforts in supporting projects and organizations sharing diversity and women-centric missions. There are 10,000 pieces and they only cost 0.05 ETH to mint. And they state that all MOW stand for diversity, inclusivity, and true equality is their tagline. And one thing here with their vision, it says, we strongly believe NFTs have a unique position to create real change in the world. Our roadmap includes support for many female-centric charities and movements. Again, very focused on empowering women, diversity, inclusivity, all of that, and they're sticking to it. They are not straying away, which I think is perfect for most projects. You need one thing to focus on and you've got your target and just go for it. They're not trying to go all over the place. They've got one, one cause and that's what they're doing. And I think that's amazing. Amazing. And the last thing I wanted to mention here, it says, with Multiverse of Women, not only will you be able to collect super awesome, unique, and diverse NFTs, but you'll be contributing to something much larger. We have plans to contribute significantly to worthy causes across the globe while also being able to give back to our awesome community members. One ambitious goal is to provide 10,000 meals to girls living in poverty. So again, another amazing cause behind this project. It's not just a money grab, which I think is an integral part to projects if they want to be successful in the long term and help build value in their NFT as well. Now, a quick overview of their roadmap. They have already launched their Discord community, and they've also got their MOW Club, which is the first 250 MOW NFT holders gained access to the club. And now there's also perks with that with limited edition airdrops, premium access, and early access to other projects. Now next, you've got their exclusive print giveaway, Discord Nitro giveaway, Ethereum raffles, and also voting rights to support female artists. And they're also buying land in Sandbox to showcase their MOW Club NFTs in the metaverse. I think they're currently still doing this, but they've moved past that 1,000 sales. But the buying of Sandbox land and also the giveaways are still going. Next at 50% sales or 5,000, they're going to be doing their community exclusive raffle and entry into the creator challenge where legendary NFTs and crypto prizes are up for grabs. Next, at 75% or 7,500 sales, you've got their merch. They're going to do exclusive merch store launching with member-only products and discount codes. And they're also going to be giving away 0.1 Ethereum to 10 
randomly selected holders. And at 100% sales or 10,000 sales, it says they're going to be doing their meals for girls in poverty. Become an MOW charity benefactor to gain voting and recommendation rights to our charitable mission, plus provide 10,000 meals to young girls in need across the globe. And I think that's their big kicker there with the giveaway of the meals. I think it's an amazing cause. Glad they're going for it. Very unique. I don't see anybody else really doing this. So I think this is a huge bonus to this project. The last thing on the roadmap here is an exclusive release of MOW NFT generator where you can get the chance to generate and mint your very own Women of Multiverse. Woman of the Multiverse. Exclusive traits and attributes will be available with 50% of version 2 profit going back to the community. I like the roadmap. It's pretty straightforward. Interested to see how it plays out here with the version 2 and the NFT generator, but I do love that 50% of the profits are going right back into the community. I think that's a great goal and looking forward to it. Now at the bottom of their page, they have a pretty extensive FAQ section of the site, but I only wanted to highlight a few of these, and you can look at more of them on their site if you would like more information. Now the first one I wanted to highlight, which I didn't see at the very front of the homepage here, and I wish it was, because I think it adds a ton of value, is each is inspired by powerful women throughout her story. I think this is huge. I think it's a huge point that they should be making the entire time because they're focusing on women. And this is a huge movement right now as well with the her story. So I think it's great. And I want I definitely wanted to highlight that here. And the only other one I wanted to highlight is how many traits are there? And here is the list, which is insane to me. 50 backgrounds, 113 hairstyles, 18 hair colors, all these different combinations here and different attributes. I really like that they put this here. I think it's great to look at and I just like seeing numbers like this. This is amazing. All right, and next we're going to look at their social media. Now coming over and taking a look at their Twitter first, they do have about 7,700 followers and I would say that they're active. Since I've been following this project, I've seen them post at least once a day, sometimes multiple times a day during giveaways and such. And one of the big things that I wanted to highlight here is they interact with other projects and the community a lot. I think there's a lot of interaction here. I love it. And you can tell that the people behind the project are passionate and the people following it with the community are very passionate about the project. So again, that's why I think this is one that's kind of a hidden gem and is only going to build over time. All right, and now looking at their Discord, their Discord does have the same amount of members, about 7,700. They are currently offering a discounted minting price at 0 0.025 Ethereum. I'm not sure how long that one's going to run, but they do have a limit on that. Now, the one thing I like about their Discord is there is a lot of information, but it, it's not overwhelming. They've got it organized and very easy to find, very straightforward. They don't go into a bunch of unrelevant information. And that being said, where I started here is the section where they show you the traits. I like that they give you a little visual on that. I know we talked about having the amount of traits, but I just like seeing the visual format of that. And next, you can see their roadmap here in text form without all the graphics. Very straightforward. They know what they're going for here, and I think it's great. Another section of their Discord is the charitable work section, and they do have different projects in here and different charities that you can take a look at and other ones that they're looking into and that are being voted on. So definitely check this section out as well if you are interested in the project because I think the charity work with this one is huge, and I think it's another unique thing that sets them apart and really happy to see this section. Also, if you want to get the official link where to mint and also where to check gas fees, they've made that easily accessible here as well. Now, while this is very straightforward, they do have a few extra sections here, like in the community zone with the mental health and other areas, but it's very wholesome, very interactive. I do like their Discord. I think it's the best place to get the most information and just interact with others in the community that are like-minded and like the project and follow it and want to help the community grow. Now, as mentioned earlier, they are doing a half off minting sale right now, and they did limit that to 1000 sales. And currently they're at 316 at the time of recording this video. So if you are watching and want to get in on the half off for the minting, definitely come over to their site, connect your MetaMask or your wallet, and you can mint for 0 0.025 Ethereum right now, which I think is a steal. And taking a look at OpenSea currently, they are at a floor price of 0 0.079. So definitely a steal to be able to mint at 0 0.025. And I, again, I think this is only going to grow. So overall with the Multiverse of Women, I love this project. I love the passion behind it. I love the community that's building this. I think everything's great. I think they are set up for success. 
but I also think it's going to be a slow burn and a more buy and hold scenario with this one. And do you think that it will explode in the future? But with that being said, I'd love to know what you guys think about this project. Are you guys involved in this one? Are you interested in minting? Or do you think this one's just going to fail? Either way, we would love to interact with you in the comments below, so let us know. And if there's another project out there that you want to get some more information on or want us to cover, leave us a comment and we'll get started on that one. Thank you for watching. Make sure you like the video and subscribe for more NFT projects like this, and we will see you in the next one.